Samsung is working on evolving new S Pen technology to make the Galaxy Z Fold 7 slimmer. The recently launched Galaxy Z Fold Special Edition is thinner than the Z Fold 6, but lacks S Pen support. To achieve this slim design, Samsung omitted the digitizer in the Z Fold Southeast, allowing internal components to remain intact while reducing thickness. Now the company aims to create a thinner foldable, without sacrificing S Pen functionality. Samsung is seriously considering removing the digitizer from the Galaxy Z Fold 7. A final decision will be made early next year on whether to include the digitizer or introduce a new pen input method to replace the existing technology. The Galaxy Z Fold Southeast is 1.5mm thinner than the Fold 6, but does not support the S Pen due to the absence of a digitizer. With its next model, Samsung hopes to combine a slim design with full pen functionality. The digitizer is essential for enabling stylus input on foldable Galaxy phones. However, Samsung is exploring a new technology that allows stylus input without requiring a digitizer. The alternative pen input solution under consideration is based on electrostatic induction. This approach results in a thicker stylus due to the built-in battery and electronic components, which require charging. However, because the display does not need additional hardware, the device itself can remain slim. The upcoming Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Flip 7 are expected to launch at the same price points as their predecessors. Before the Galaxy S25 series debuted, rumors hinted at significant price increases due to rising production costs, with predictions of over $100 hikes depending on the model and storage variant. However, when Samsung unveiled its latest flagships, the pricing largely mirrored that of the Galaxy S24 series in most major markets, including the US. Even in regions where prices did increase, the adjustments were relatively minor. Now a new leak suggests Samsung plans to follow a similar pricing strategy for its next-generation foldables. According to ex-leaker Panda Flash Pro, the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Flip 7 are expected to maintain their existing price points in most markets. If accurate, US pricing should remain unchanged with the Galaxy Z Flip 7 starting at $1,100 and the Z Fold 7 at $1,900. Last year, Samsung increased the base prices of the Galaxy Z Flip 6 and Fold 6 by $100 compared to their predecessors. This year, the company appears to be prioritizing price stability. Additionally, Samsung is rumored to be developing a more affordable Galaxy Z Flip Fan Edition and a premium trifold model. Samsung is reportedly planning to launch at least four new foldable phones this year and some are expected to feature a new version of Qualcomm's Snapdragon 8 Elite chip. Qualcomm recently unveiled a trimmed-down variant of the Snapdragon 8 Elite, which has one less CPU core compared to the standard version. The 7-core Snapdragon 8 Elite is rumored to power the Galaxy Z Fold 7. The new 7-core Snapdragon 8 Elite is designed with a 64-bit architecture and utilizes TSMC's advanced 3 in process. It features a configuration of two prime cores clocked up to 4.32 GHz and five performance cores reaching up to 3.53 GHz while its architecture aims to address overheating concerns seen in the standard variant with its custom Orion CPU, the reduced core count slightly impacts performance. Tech expert Michelle Rahman noted that this modified chip could generate less heat, making it a better fit for foldable devices like the Galaxy Z Fold 7. Alongside the Fold 7, Samsung's Galaxy Z Fold Special Edition 2 is also expected to adopt this cooler 7-core Snapdragon 8 Elite chip. Meanwhile, the Galaxy Z Flip 7 might rely on Samsung's in-house Exynos 2500 chipset, while the Galaxy Z Flip Fan Edition could use the Exynos 2400. This diversification of processors highlights Samsung's continued strategy of combining Qualcomm and Exynos chips in its lineup. Notably, the Snapdragon 8 Elite for Galaxy, featured in the upcoming Galaxy S25 series, offers a performance boost with a CPU frequency of up to 4.47 GHz higher than the standard Snapdragon 8 Elite's 4.32 GHz. This version is expected to deliver enhanced power, further differentiating the flagship S25 series from Samsung's foldable range, and foldable innovations like the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Z Flip 7 on the horizon, Samsung is gearing up for a strong lineup this year. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed the video, remember to give a like to the video and subscribe to the channel, and I see you in the next video. Peace out.